this is Jules again, and today we're discuss the least understood concept within the DeFi universe. It is AMM, Automated Market Makers. So what does this concept actually mean? So how a traditional order book works and how any exchange works in the real world and what's the difference between the ordinary exchange and the AMM? So let's find out and do some math uh within this video so uh first of all let's find out how the traditional uh order book works and traditional exchange for instance john wants to sell ten dollars so we have john who wants to sell ten dollars okay and on the other side um we have a wheel who wants um to buy nine dollars so um okay and the role of the exchange uh is to match both orders together so it's like exchange is a matchmaking uh service so uh you want suppose you want to uh, sell 10 usdt at ten dollars and on the other side uh someone wants to buy five usdt at nine dollars and these two agree in the middle and um uh, someone uh thinks that okay uh i won't uh sell a usdt at ten dollars because no one buys it so i'm okay with 9.95 dollars and on the other side someone thinks okay i won't be okay with the nine so i'll uh buy it for 9.75 and they meet at 9.5 dollars so that's actually how the exchange works and you need to find the price uh without losing like too much value and that's uh, actually the difficulty of order book and the issue of smart contracts is that they are very slow and expensive so a traditional order book won't work uh within this system on a smart contract it is actually awful it takes uh, from one to five minutes approximately and the fee is big we already know it we've all witnessed how it happens by the way uh, if you want to watch uh, more transactions uh, we're processing uh, live you can watch our tutorial videos on our official youtube channel just subscribe uh click on the subscribe button right under this video and press the bell the bell in order not to miss anything that is happening on our official youtube channel and we go on so um this issue of smart contracts is that they are slow and expensive as i already mentioned so amm solves uh, this problem for smart contracts uh, there is no order book. Uh, smart contract calculates the price. The users decide to sell or buy at a pre-calculated price. Uh, for instance, John goes to the smart contract and gets his price. The price is calculated on the basis of ratio between two tokens. So uh, how can we calculate the ratio? It's very simple. Scheme X y and this is ratio it never changes uh and let's suppose the price of ethereum is 100 dollars and uh the price of um i don't know let's say usdt is one dollar Okay, uh, so we supply uh, 10 Ethereum and 1000 USDT, it is 10,000. Okay, and the price of Ethereum will be calculated this way. It is Y divided by X which is 1000 divided by 10 which is 100 and usdt is x divided by y it is uh, 10 divided by 
1000 and it is 0 0.01. So uh, when someone makes uh, a trade, he gives like a quantity to pool to take another one. And suppose you want to buy one Ethereum from this pool. Uh, this means giving Ethereum to the pool and taking USDT in return. So uh, according from this, according to this scheme, it is 10 minus one multiplied by 10,000 plus X. So it is our 10,000. 10, so we've got nine multiplied by 10 plus X. And it is our 10,000. So, uh, 1,000 plus X, it is 10,000 divided by 9 and 1,000 plus X, it is this number, actually. Okay, and from here, we know that X, it is 1000 minus 1000.111 minus, minus uh, 1000. And it is $111. So that's how actually this scheme works. Uh, so uh, to buy one Ethereum from the pool, they will pay $111. Uh, as you see, that happened uh, simply uh, because the ratio of Ethereum and USDT changed. But if somebody else brings the price back, they get Ethereum from, for instance, from Coinbase. And uh, right now we have like nine Ethereum multiplied by uh, 1,111 uh, USDT. It is 10,000. Uh, so you can have actually $11 profit by giving this Ethereum back to the pool. And uh, to sum up, we must say that AMM is a very powerful, cool thing because like you give two quantities to the pool and it gives you the correct price. So that's how arbitrage uh, earn profits. They can restore the price just by selling back to the pool the moment the price changes. So that's actually how it works. Uh, I hope right now you understand much better what's the difference between AMM and uh, uh, usual exchanges. Uh, if you still want to see more tutorials, just click on that subscribe button right under this video and subscribe on our YouTube channel. Press the like button if you like this video to watch more at the moment. That's it. Thank you. That was Jules and bye-bye.